Okay, this video is going to be about more about the retarded nonsense uh, called Flat Earth. Uh, we're just going to look at a few of the retarded videos and make a few uh, common sense uh, comments, basically. The sun rises at 7.17 in the morning and it sets at 4.32 in the afternoon. And on December 21st, when the sun is over your longitude, it's okay, let's just pause this here. Okay, so what he's saying is that the sun rises at this point and it's along this line, which he calls the Tropic of Capricorn or whatever, okay? So the sun is travelling along this circle around the flat earth, which is also a circle, okay? Even though that there's been flat earthers who've taken pictures of the earth, apparently They've got footage that the Earth is like. Uh, well, I'll show you a picture of it, but it's, it's it's like about that shape, you know. But they've got it as a circle. And so, what they're saying is, is that there's light here, okay, and then there's light here. So that that sunrise, according to their schedule, and then the sun sets over here, according to where they are in America, okay. Now, if the sun is continuing around this circle, which he's saying it is, okay, then what about uh, Australia? Yeah? I mean, how is that going to get any sun? What about, I mean, this, if the South Pole is out here, if there's no such thing as the South Pole and it's just an outer rim, okay, then... You know, what what is the explanation there, exactly? Because if the sun travels along maybe this line, which obviously is saying that the seasons maybe start here in the winter time and go all the way in up here, okay? Now, can you imagine the sun traveling just around this part? That would mean that the North Pole would be like a tropical area, okay? And if the sun was travelling further out, like in another season, it would mean that the so-called South Pole or Outer Rim would be a tropical area, and this entire area would be absolutely freezing, which would be the most of the Earth, actually. So this model makes no sense. It's retarded. It's completely retarded. So if you can imagine that this is the flat Earth, okay, and that the world is on top here, and whatever is below here, maybe hell, whatever, okay. And around the edges you've got the uh, outer rim, which is cold, which is ice. Now if you have a sun coming up on the horizon, okay, then it means that the outer rim is not going to be snow, okay. It's not going to be snow. If, you, if you're getting it coming up here and setting over here, or coming up here and setting over here it means that this part which they call the South Pole which is the outer rim will be a tropical area it won't have any snow on it okay that's just another thing that I've noticed now this is the so-called rocket uh, made by maybe flat earthers I don't know and that's meant to be a camera on the rocket okay and in a second is going to hit something which they call a glass ceiling, right? They call it. And by the by, if it was a rocket, wouldn't you think if it hit anything solid that it would explode? Okay. But let's just see this. So they're saying that the earth has got a dome, a glass dome on top of it. There we go. Okay. Now that looks to me as if it's uh, probably several miles up. Okay. I mean it's taken literally about less than a minute from taking off to hitting the glass dome. Okay. So you're talking it must be maybe several miles up, but it won't be like hundreds of miles up, okay? Now here's another camera 
this time they're saying it's 33 kilometers up which is much further up than the previous camera was and what they don't explain is how this camera um, got up there and the flat earthers say that uh, satellites are also a myth so what is this thing? it's a dog cam apparently right? it's not a satellite okay but it's 33 kilometers up so it must have passed the glass dome it must have so how, how do the flat earthers explain that? okay now this is the way that we explain the seasons on the earth now the earth actually tilts uh, during the summer in the north uh, the earth shall be tilted towards uh, the sun there and in the winter time the northern hemisphere is tilted away away from the sun okay so that's how we explain the seasons and the uh, global or the you know uh, the, the global earth that we describe okay that's how we explain it this is just another random video on YouTube that talk, they say this about flat earth mass murders and not a single uh, point in the video are they talking about flat earth there's like Bill Cooper in there there's all kind of people talking right they're not talking about flat earth they're talking about aliens here not flat earth, okay? <clears throat> and there's, there's hundreds of these videos. It's because all these flat earthers have nothing better to do with their time than to research this red herring, which can never be proven. Never be proven. Because it's not logical, it's not... It's, it can't be proven, it's not scientific, okay? The scientific... Uh, method is that it must be proven logically and this is like about September the 11th and flat earth what's, what's September the 11th got to do with flat earth 